Yeah, yeah just, just making sure that you're safe. That's the utmost concern. Safety first, and then let's worry about efficacy. Hey, everyone. My name is Dr. Nick Halsey with Modus Nova. I'm a licensed neurophysical therapist and neuroscientist helping brain injury survivors understand how to make functional gains after their injury. I hope this video helps you in your recovery. One of the things that I noticed about using the, uh, the Modus hand is that um, my pinky on my left hand kind of sticks up. So it doesn't lay flat in the device. And, okay. and with the foam on the device, it's great because it's comfortable. Okay. But the problem is, is I feel like I get more of a stretch if I shove my finger down there on top of my pinky and hold it down. So whatever I'm doing those stretches with the device, I'm yeah. really getting a good stretch and I can feel okay. it. And it seems like it's really helping with my tone and my spacity. spacity. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reasonable, reasonable thoughts there. I'd say one thing I would want to mention, if your pinky is coming out, it could be because of one of two things. One is your wrist is a little bit misaligned, which then causes a chain reaction to happen up here. Um, so I want to check that out. The alternative thing is if this pad can also be um, loosened on the front, these two Velcro straps can be loosened. And okay. it can basically come over the top more. So I would really encourage you, Elijah, to really take a good look at that. Because the thing we want to do is you want to have fairly good coverage. And so you're exactly right. You're, the anatomy of the fingers is such that there's a little bit of a curvature there, right? You can kind of see my pinky curling up a little bit. But if you have your pinky, and it will naturally come out like this. This, okay. is, a, this is okay. This is not the ideal position here. But we want it to be a bit more covered than this. So you can okay. kind of see, you can kind of see my fingers there. But what, in my case, what I would do is I would loosen these two Velcro straps, and that would give you more kind of purchase to come up over the top. Okay, that would I've be noticed, my recommendation. Okay, yeah, I mean, I feel like it doesn't matter how tight I get it around there. It feels like that give on the cushioning part lets that not as you know, it doesn't hurt. So what I do is sure. I've just been shoving things down there to keep my knuckle flat. It's okay. probably like I have credit cards down there. I'm really, cause it really does make a difference. Sure. Sure. I, I will say this. Um, if that's the case, Elijah, and this is for everyone too, if you have to do modifications, do skin checks and you're already going to be really good at this. You've been in rehab long enough. I'm sure it's been, been hounded on you many, many times. Make sure you do skin checks, right? Cause okay. the last thing we're going to do is causing a skin breakdown. So really do do um, a good thorough job. And if you find something that, that works for you, great. If it's not causing skin breakdown, great. Stick with it. Um, and I, I encourage modifications if it will help you get more out of it. Very cool. Yeah. yeah just, just making sure that you're safe. That's the utmost concern. Safety first, and then let's worry about efficacy. So, see, I've never worried about the safety thing. So, I'm still sure. trying to get a hold of that concept. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Uh, I'll be here to remind you each day. Thanks for watching this video. If you have questions or would like to speak with me about how you can make functional gains from home, call or text me at 404-939-3476 or visit modusnova.com contact.